Hello guys, what I'm going to show you today is how you can create image hover effects inside of Webflow. Okay, now the first thing that we need to do is to insert an image. Okay, so we're going to go to this section, which is empty. Okay, and we're just going to go to this plus icon, which is add element. Now you need to search for an image here. Okay, so let's drag it here, for example. And now we're just going to replace it with a random image, which in my case is going to be like this guy here, for example. Okay, and this size is actually good for me, it's decent. So now, you basically want to select this image and you want to go to Interactions, okay? And in Element Trigger, you want to click on this Add button and you want to click on Mouse Hover, okay? Which means that as you hover through this, you know, image, as you pass through it with your mouse, a certain effect is going to be created, okay? And from here, you can select what action you want to become or what actions you want to perform here, okay? You have multiple of them, okay? But I guess that for a mouse hover, what's gonna look the better is either, you know, a grow or shrink or spin. And also, uh, you know, opacity animations, which are actually, you know, you have to custom made, okay? There is no preset for that, okay? You can also use, for example, something like a bounce and things like that, okay? So let's actually select, I don't know, the grow option here, for example, okay? Let's preview it. Look at this. Okay, as we hover through it with the mouse, it's going to actually grow. Okay, let's click on preview to see it better. But look what's, what's going to happen. If I hover through it, it's going to grow basically. Okay. And you can actually modify the different settings of this hover. Okay, by going to your, you know, action that you just created and by clicking on delay. All right. So that's pretty much it. You can also, by the way, go to grow out. Okay, if that's what you want. Okay. That's it, guys. Thank you so much.